you'll read it all over in all these women's books about relationships that one of the biggest complaints women have about men is all they think about is sex Asperger's males don't think that way we don't think just about sex it's certainly one of our thoughts but it's not the only thought so in theory we would be the best choices for women we would be their top choices alas alas it's not the case they often go for exactly what they say they hate they like the players and the bad boys I think these bad boy fetishes are very very silly but that's the way many females think I even read this one male magazine for him that they were mocking how the women's magazines are saying we want a guy who listens but what they really want is a stud and there's a lot of truth to that as sad as it is women often will go for those bad boys instead of somebody who listens they don't like nice guys whenever you're called a nice guy it's a kiss of death it's not the way it should be it's not the way I wish it was but it's the case now there are certainly some women who are strong enough and wise enough to see it the other way unfortunately there's not enough of those and unfortunately it may be few and far between but it can be very satisfying to see women who exalt these bad boys and players the media images and then they get burned by them it's really ironic because some of these women have the greatest social sophistication and we lack it to the utmost and then they go out and make mistakes that have far more serious consequences than we could ever get into when you're when you have Asperger's syndrome dating is usually one calamity after another thus it can be oddly satisfying to see these women who reject you get pregnant by some player and then they find out this bad boy isn't going to be around bad boys are fun during the bad times I'm sorry during the good times but whenever there's any challenge whenever there's any circumstance that demands character they're out of there so it's a little reward but we need to hang in there for those truly wise and truly strong women because they know what's good and I don't want to get in the rut that I'm going to become a hater of women because of foolish mistakes made by women then I become what I hate and I don't want that